So uh, this is the quick tour of the energy lab. Um, it's basically a lot of open space that we can change for the workouts and the groups that we have, but sludge hammers for uh, tire work. Um, we have kettlebells from 10 pounds um, all the way up to a lot heavier, 106. Um, mostly in pairs for different types of loaded carries, um, swings and all the kettlebell classics. Boxes for stepping and jumping drills. Stability balls for midsection work, sandbags. And then of course the um, traditional setup for benching, squatting, deadlifting. We do a lot of our suspension work off this rack as well, so TRX exercises. Um, you can see there's a lot of chain. We use the chain to add resistance to body weight exercises, and we also uh, use the chain for bar uh, work as well. And then um, along with the TRX, we have rings for pulling and pushing exercises. In the corner we have a prowler for when it's icy or lightning outside. We use that inside for um, conditioning. Obviously um, a dip station for body weight work, foam rollers for movement prep, dumbbells, landmine, climbing rope for grip strength, um, arm development, and then medicine balls galore for throwing uh, midsection work, bands for our warm ups and for some of our uh, body weight strength exercises. We do a lot of jump rope, so make sure you're ready to jump rope. If you can't jump rope, you'll learn how. Most days of the year, uh, we have the opportunity to do work outside of the gym, in and out of the gym, uh, the whole session. We use the tractor tire here outside for striking with sludge hammers. We use the battling ropes for upper body conditioning and grip strength. And then almost every workout we're dragging sleds for calorie burn conditioning and leg work. Um, some of our clients will do uh, percentage runs out here. They're working on stride length and efficiency and recovery. So we'll use this open area um, most days. So dress in layers. <laughs>